Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel, and this is a uh, interesting new um, video of uh, feature that will eventually roll out to everybody eventually, starting with the latest uh, October 2020 update, and um, it has to do with updates. So right now there are several things that update in different manners in Windows 10. We all know that you know the main system core, the bug fixes, and all of that come through the uh, Windows updates, and so a lot of things actually arrive here, uh, and uh, we have these updates that roll out in different schedules. So of course there's the uh, Patch Tuesday updates that are always on the second Tuesday, but we have other bug fixing updates um, in the weeks that are, are after. Now some apps also have updates through what is the Microsoft Store. Microsoft Store is another place where some of the apps that you have installed actually come through updates. And this is a flexible way of updating apps because it actually doesn't need you to go to Windows Update or wait for a Windows Update to actually be here. But Microsoft is going to test something. It's actually testing it now in the uh, beta channel in the Insiders. And um, a lot of people over the, you know over time asked, what is the Windows Feature Experience Pack? And a lot of people didn't really have an answer or a clear answer to that. Well, it seems that Microsoft is going to roll out a, a Windows Feature Experience Pack to uh, everybody eventually through Windows Update. And that is going to actually be another way of updating some parts of the operating system. To give you an example, tweaks and changes to the start menu could come through the experience pack. So instead of having to wait for a, you know, officially for a uh, Windows update to update the core of the start menu and stuff like that. There could be uh, these updates could actually come from the experience packs. So this is kind of interesting because it would update certain apps and certain uh, parts of the operating system, and they wouldn't have to wait for us to get anything through Windows update for that. It also would be seamless. It would actually happen kind of in the background. And I think this has a lot to do with uh, testing out how uh, they can actually have as many updates without you actually noticing them and not going through, you know, the hoops of always having to update with big cumulative updates and so in the Windows updates. So this is interesting. Uh, and the first test has been done in the Insider Rings in the beta channel. And it seems that this might actually be what could happen in 2021 is we'll have the Windows feature experience packs and through there some parts of the system can be updated. Of course it can't update everything but um, you know the start menu could be uh, tweaked and updated. There are some apps like the snip and sketch or snipping tool that could be updated and so on. So this is going to be an interesting part of Windows and I think it has to do with Windows 10 X. Windows 10 X has a lot of uh, we all you know, when it comes out, we know that it's supposed to have seamless updates in the background that we don't really um, notice and that a uh, little bit like a smartphone, we don't really notice the update and it's like, yeah, they're at the latest version. Well, um, I think it's trying to have Windows 10 be as seamless as possible if they can. So this is going to be an interesting part of uh, checking out what's going to happen in 2021. And of course, as soon as the Windows feature experience pack actually really gets in uh, every Windows that the version required for that gets into all versions of Windows, we're uh, going to talk about it, of course, as soon as it is released eventually. So it is now being tested in the Insider Rings. That means that uh, it will eventually roll out to all of us in Windows and um, we'll see what happens with that. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you for watching.